The seed of adventure was planted right here at the Bonneville Salt Flats in Utah. When Mickey was only eight, his father took him and his sister, Colleen, on a short vacation. The young boy was immediately mesmerized by the vastness of the area. Even more inspirational was being able to watch this man, John Cobb, establish a new land speed record of 396 miles per hour. The year was 1939, and the British automobile industry had decided to use a land speed record as a means to advertise their product. Nothing was spared to make this as safe and successful a land speed run as possible. The car was very large, even by standards of those days. It required the use of two huge 16-cylinder Napier Lion airplane engines, pouring out 5,000 horsepower to drive this heavy vehicle across the salt. Cobb was successful, and the British got everything they had bargained for. The International Press Corps was on the scene, and the world had a new hero. It would take about 20 years before Mickey Thompson would return to these salt flats. And then it would be to try and break this very record. 